my name is Pricey, and I'm going to talk about all my boyfriends and my current husband that's cheating me. I think he's a sex addict, to be quite honest. <laughs> Anyone else that says a celebrity big brother in the UK, like, I am obsessed with that show so, so, so much. I love it. I love Pricey, and Alicia just went home and I loved her. I love Kavanaugh. Hate Prince Hilton. I love Katie Hopkins. Don't like Nadia. <laughs> Nadia kind of reminds me of Helena Bone Carter. Kind of like you really are. I'm gonna talk like this. And I'm gonna stand up for everything in the house. But I'm not gonna take blame for anything I do. <laughs> That's my UK impressions. Um, anyways, this uh, video is not about horrible, horrible British impressions. Sorry, don't mean to offend anyone over in the UK. I love you guys so much. Um, no, this is a simply spoiled unboxing. So I was unboxing this box and I got to the palettes, I took the palettes off and I was like, oh, okay, let me just take this off because you know I was going to like try it out and then I'm like, maybe I'll include some in a beauty haul. Um, but then when I took the palettes out, there was all this little cuteness inside and I just, I couldn't help but like share it with you guys. It's just like, oh my gosh, this is like a really cute like um, little unboxing video. So I thought I would just do like a full on proper unboxing video because I did order some things and then they just sent me a bunch of things. So I'm like, I'm just going to do an unboxing haul because I I love Simply Spoiled Cosmetics for a while, but um, I just reached when they reached out to me and they were just like, hey, we want to send you more. I was like, wait, really? Because, I don't know, sometimes I get that. Sometimes when I order things, they're like, hey, are you a blogger? <laughs> I'm like, yeah. So, um, so I thought I would do an unboxing for you guys. By the way, my sweatshirt says wifey and I'm single. So, if that makes any sense to you, you should be in Mensa. Mensa? Meta. <laughs> Mensa? <laughs> I don't know. One time I was told my IQ was high enough to be in Mensa. But I don't even know if that's the right thing. But I used to have a really high IQ. High IQ. High IQ. <laughs> well, let's get into this unboxing. Okay, so let's just start with the palettes, which are the things that I ordered. I was expecting the palettes, and I wasn't expecting all the goodies underneath. So I'm a big palette person. As you guys know, I absolutely love palette. Oh, here's a little postcard. Here's a little postcard that says I got some for review. Um, oh, my promotional code is Trish, and it can get you 40% off at... Simply Spoiled Beauty Products, so that's cool, awesome, I didn't even know I was getting a discount code, so more excitement in this unboxing, okay, so I will start with the palettes, and it has all the ingredients in the back, which I kind of like, do you ever find it a little sketchy when there's like not all the ingredients listed on the back, I mean most major beauty companies do, but I had ordered, it's a whole other thing, it was like a nightmare unboxing basically, um, I didn't do the unboxing, but it would have been a nightmare unboxing, but I had ordered a bunch of products, and they didn't have any ingredients in the back, and I put them in my eye, and I thought I had pink eye. I know everyone's probably like, oh my gosh, I have pink eye, but it's kind of like just a look I'm going for. It's called the pink eye look. You know, trying to make that happen. But long story short, like, I legit, I think, gave me pink eye. Um, and I was like, okay. But maybe I should actually have done a video on it. But sometimes I don't like talking bad about companies, but then I'm like, no, maybe I should actually. That one was bad. And I actually purchased that one too. That wasn't even like a review or anything. I was like purchased and oh, yeah. um, But anyways, so this is the first palette I got and it is a blush palette. And I love this blush palette because out of all the palettes there are, I have never seen a blush palette with this many colors. Um, and that's what got me really, 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 really excited. So there's all the colors that come in it. Now there is just a wide range of blushes going on. So I have a NARS blush palette. I think I have a Cap on D one. I have, I think I might have two NARS blush palettes to be honest. I have a Tarte one. I have a lot of blush palettes. I have ones that I built at MAC and none of them even come close to the variety of colors that this is. This is just every single blush you will ever, ever want. And it's also really affordable. Um, what I learned is like whenever you see like little black palettes like this that open like this, um, you know, the packaging isn't like super fancy, um, but I've learned that that's when you know you're getting an inexpensive product. But the quality, like I said, I've tried out, I think I've only tried out three Simply Spoiled products and one of them was their blush and I absolutely love it. It was just like a sample one. But first of all, right away, this color is sticking out to me. I don't know what it is. I've been loving orange blushes lately and I just think that is so, so pretty. So they're really pigmented. Um, this is really pretty, this mauve one. I just think it's really cool, like, if you if you want a variety of blushes. Like, some people only like one blush, like, one, one blush, one color on their cheek, and they're, like, they're, they, they love it, they're used to it, like, benefit, like, if you like Bella Bomba, like, that's what they, like, live for for two years. But I just like to change mine up depending on, like, the look. Even, like, today, I'm, like, sometimes I wear a really nude lip or bright lip, but it's, like, depending on what I want to feel, and if you're going for the pink eye look, if you're going for the pink eye look, you could use this, these colors for your pink eye look, because I had to use 500 different pinks. And who buys pink eyeshadow except for me? Like, really, like, honestly. I should have baby wipes, I'm just gonna do that. <laughs> um, okay, so 
So next palette is the Perfection Palette. And the Perfection Palette is a contour palette. So once again, the first thing I noticed about these is how large <laughs> the product is. Again, when you buy palettes, you tend to not get the full size that you would if you were to buy a full size because you're kind of just getting a little sampler of everything. But this is like a pretty full size bronzer highlight kind of duo, but this is a great contouring kit as far as I can tell because right away I see the um, the sort of yellow banana color, if you will, which is way less expensive than the regular banana powder, and that's great for um, setting your under eyes with concealer. Uh, this white is a great highlight where if you want to highlight your cheekbones, which I did a little right there, but not with this one today. Um, and then I love, again, a contour kit that has variety because I just, sometimes I self tan, sometimes I don't, like sometimes I do a lot, sometimes I'll do it every single day, sometimes I won't go over months, so I always need a different sort of contour. So this one is super, this is one of the darkest uh, bronzer contouring colors I've ever seen to be honest um, which I think is awesome because for girls who like to be really tan or for you know dark skinned girls um, it's great because then you can get that deep defined contour um, you know without having you know it's just it's hard I know I've, I watch a lot of like darker skinned girls and a lot of times they do have trouble finding contouring and but me too because when I tan I tan and um, I definitely would like this darker one so I just like that there's a lot of variety and a lot of options and um, something that you know if someone needs to use a contour it's really nice and I just love the size of this I mean these are huge huge sizes um, so really impressed with this and that is called the perfection palette I don't think this one had like a name on it but yeah um, so as you can tell, I mean, obviously blushes are always a little smaller anyways than bronzers, but this one is nice. And what I like about it too is I believe they were mostly matte. Yeah, they're all matte, which is awesome. I, I don't mind a shimmer bronzer, like the Riri bronzer from MAC was like okay, but not a huge fan. I don't need to be like shining all over my face. And the final palette I got was this. So inside of this was shadows. It's a shadow palette and it has a bunch of different colors, variety of colors and options. Again, I like these more inexpensive palettes for this kind of thing because who's going to go buy all those shades? And when you want to do color, if you don't want to, because, okay, my traditional go-to eye is white lid. I put a color for the blending color and then I put black, like, to do the outer V. But it would be nice to get, like, a darker green to deepen your lid and with the lighter green. You know, it's nice to have a different variety of shades. So I do like that. Again, I never tried the Simply Spoiled eyeshadow, so I'm really excited to try those. So I thought, why not just go get a palette of them? Um, again, for the price, you just really can't beat. So I got this, and I will try these out and let you guys know what I think about those. And they did just sit in one on top of each other like this. If you guys want to know how it came in your little... Palette. Okay, so now on to a complete surprise. I really don't even know what to expect in this bag and or in this box rather and I'm like super excited. The first thing I see are the Simply Spoiled lipsticks which I love. I was, I think I was sent these or maybe there was in some sort of gift bag. I used to go to like beauty events like a long time ago and I, I believe these were in it and they were so, so great. I don't know if this was the packaging but I do remember the name Simply Spoiled and oh my gosh and they have the little mirrors in the back. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, I might be out of my damn mind, but I swear when I was taking off the wrapping of either cheese, this smells like ice cream. <laughs> like it smells like sherbet or something. This is called Simply Pink. And what is so cool is there's like a mirror on the back of these. Like I, I've seen the mirrored lip glosses, but I've never seen the mirrored lipsticks. Wait, I'm so confused. Oh my gosh, and these light up too. This is so, I love, I love little light up products like that. Oh my gosh, and then they have the little thing. That is such a smart idea for lipsticks. So, um, definitely not the ones I did try out, but I am obsessed. That's what that one looks like. That's a really pretty, like, mauve color. Gorgeous. There's a lot of lipstick in there, too. I love it. Oh, my gosh. And I love There's, like, a little, like, light. That's, ah, oh, so clever. So clever. I love, I mean, I swear to goodness, makeup companies are, like, the smartest people in the world. Like, they should be, like, curing cancer because it's like, how the heck do they do this? Okay. This one, I believe, was the Simply, or this was Scarlet, I think. Yeah. And that's what that one looks like. Let's watch it. A really nice deep red. They have a little bit of sheen to them, a little bit. I was gonna say they're pretty matte, but it almost looks a little tiny sheen. And then this one is lovely. Ooh, and it is lovely. It has like a nude with like a really subtle sparkle to it. Really, really gorgeous. Put that right there. Yeah, that's gorgeous. I love just like really like nude nude colors. I think they're so pretty. It just kind of makes your lip look natural, and I, I kind of am in, into that at the moment. Like, how freaking cute would this be for Valentine's Day, guys? Like, oh my gosh, like if you just got, like, a cute little box of this. And like I said, again, affordable cosmetics. It's like you can get, like, a bunch of this and, like, really impress your friends. This is like crazy. Okay, I feel like they sent, I don't know if this is all available. Oh my gosh. 
they have an appetite control as I'm just well this is like <laughs> oh, I love it I kind of I had no idea first of all should I be offended that they sent me weight loss thing <laughs> I'm just kidding um oh my gosh there's an energy formula okay so there's vitamin b12 and then there's garcina cambogia so this is a dietary supplement and they both support weight loss and appetite control but there's two different ones it says beauty products and this one doesn't so I'm assuming this one's like more hardcore I have to look it up. But I like this, the vitamin B12 for energy. Um, I do take appetite suppressants, but they're like in a green, tea for, a green tea form. Let me just open this up and see the difference in the look of the pill. Oh, they're like, do you see they're like little pink pills in there? <laughs> I'm trying to see what it smells like. I don't know what that smells like. For adults, take one a day, two times daily, preferably with meals. Intense, I'm excited. You know what? I don't think I've like, ever bought in, bought in, <laughs> like, oh my god, like, that's even a word. I don't think I've ever bought, oh my god, I'm, like, losing my mind. Okay, so that's that one. Let's open this one. My nails are just, I literally, I don't even know how I keep fake nails on. I just dig right in. Oh, okay, these are more of, like, look like diet hardcore, yeah. They're pretty big pills. Those don't really smell as good, but diet pills never smell good. Like, that's not ever a thing that smells good. Even the green tea ones, I'm just like, mm. But I'm definitely going to try these out because I do, my problem is food. That's for sure. I always feel hungry, and I'm, I know that's, like, probably not a normal thing to always feel hungry. So, I'll be going to take that for sure and try that out. And here's a little pink bag of something. This is so cute, too. Oh, my God, I'm, like, so into Valentine's Day. If you guys can't tell by my little background, I just have, like, I just thought they were cute. I'm just, like, into pink. I'm just, like, a pink person lately. Okay, these are, are these Simply Spoil? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I will know for sure, but I, I think so, because what else would they send? It says, Me Seeker Professional Nail System. These are mood color changing nail polishes. I wonder if these work on your toes. Because first of all, the most beautiful color right there, that's like a watermelon, it reminds me of watermelon lemonade from Lucille's Barbecue, which is my favorite place in the whole world. And then this little purple guy right here is like so, so cute. I've been loving like purples and blues. I love it. I wonder if this works on your toes. This is called Mellow Crazy, and this is called, wait, what? Excited Bored. Oh, mellow, crazy, excited board. I mean, definitely catering to bipolar people. <laughs> they picked the right target. Okay, this is a lip gloss, great vitamin. <gasps> oh my gosh, wait, wait, wait. Is this the one that's like, this is, I think this might be the one that like plumps your lip. I think this is a lip plumper. <gasps> oh my gosh, I've seen these on Instagram. Where's my little lipstick mirror? Oh, I gotta peel it off. Ah, this is a really cool mirror, by the way. Oh my gosh, I think this is the one that plumps your lip because it says, distributed by IOU Cosmetic Beverly Hills. Like, I just feel like it would be like a plus history thing. I've, I've seen this up on Instagram. Oh my god, I'm like so excited to try it right now. I heard it like stings like a bee. Oh, first of all, it smells amazing. It smells like grape, which it says on the bottle. Do my lips look fuller? I'm kind of obsessed. I kind of want to just put more on. So far, no stinging. Maybe I was just like made that up in my head. I mean hurt or anything but it does look plumper I can't really see that far my viewfinder is like <laughs> you guys are like oh let me put on my hand like <laughs> like my arm doesn't even reach the camera like you guys are like right I have to like lean forward to touch you so it's kind of far and my eyesight's not the best so does it look plumper let me know this is so cool though. I've seen this on Instagram so many times the IOU vitamin E lip gloss grape yeah I'm so so excited about this Oh my gosh, like how cute is this packaging? I just like love little like bags like this. If you can't tell, that's my feel like Trish um, Valentine's Day bag, which I have a video coming up about that. But uh, I love these kind of bags. I just think they're like the cutest little thing because you can throw your jewelry in there. You can put them on the go for your makeup. I just, I like love these little bags. I think they're like the cutest thing ever. Oh my gosh, they sent me two more of those lip glosses. This is strawberry and grape. Okay. I'm going to take a picture of these on my Instagram, and if you guys want to win these, comment on my Instagram, because something's weird with, like, YouTube contests, but if you guys want to win these, comment on my Instagram and tell me why you want to win these, and tag at Simply Spoiled on it, and it'll be really fun, because I think they might have sent me these for giveaways, or not, I don't know, or not, I mean, I already have a grape one, so I'm not going to try these out, and I'm going to keep these for you guys in my little, my little, my little special place over there, which is just my ottoman, but it's my special place, um, so yeah, I will uh, Instagram that either now with the day of filming, or I'll put it up when I put this video up, but probably the day of filming because I like to put, oh, no, I'll put it when the video goes up. That way it's not, like, confusing to go back and, like, find it. Um, okay, here's another one, which maybe is for a giveaway, but I kind of want to keep these because these are eyeshadow crayons. And I am so, 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 so excited. These are eyeshadow sticks. I've been wanting to try these out because I know um, they're similar ones, but I've heard these are very pigmented, and I like how shimmery they are because they remind me of Xenon Girl of the 21st century. 
Oh my gosh, this white and teal one though. Look at me to try this now. Okay, so these are what the shimmer sticks look like. This is for big and smoky eyes in Santi, I believe, color 04 white. And then this one is, um, okay, so this is a navy blue color 01, navy blue, which doesn't look navy blue. It's kind of teal. So let's swatch these babies out. Let's swatch them out over, let's do it up here. <gasps> yes, look at that color. Oh my gosh, how beautiful is that? Oh my gosh. What I love about these two, because as you can see, that was a thin line and I just made it thicker, but like, look. You could use it as eyeliner with like a thin line. That is so gorgeous. I kind of want to like streak my face with this now. It reminds me, these remind me so much of like Gem. Gem and the Holograms? Yeah, Gem and the Holograms. And then this one I love because you guys know, as you can tell, I already have some white shadow on. Like, white shadow. Is that a name of a movie? Like a superhero? Like, white shadow. Um, I don't know, but let me see. It's gorgeous too. My hand's very tan. I love, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, these are so, so cool. I'm gonna have so much fun with these. They're very, very pigmented. I love that they sent me a black one too because I love me it's so smoky. I own this gold one. This bronze though. Dead, dead. Look at that bronze right there. Gorge, gorge, gorge. I just, I can't, I can't even right now. These are gorgeous. Definitely the favorite thing that I've unboxed from here so far. They're just, I can't even, I can't. This is so gorgeous. It's so gorgeous. Oh my God, my hand is gorgeous. <gasps> yes! I needed one of these so much. This is a power bank. It's a backup battery. Oh my god, do they sell these at Simply Spoiled? I'm like so confused. Okay, I'm gonna like double check. Okay, but I think they probably do because I don't know why they would send me stuff that wouldn't be there. So, uh, this is awesome they sell this there. I love this so much. Oh my god, there's a leopard one, but this pink zebra one matches my flattering because I love pink zebra so much. Oh my gosh, and you just, it kind of fits any like, um, cord. So, like, whatever your iPhone is, like, it just takes that little like USB cable cord and you plug it into here. Oh my gosh, yes. Because you charge this up and then you have a backup battery. I love it because I don't use, I don't have a Mophie. Like, my phone's like literally right here. I don't have a Mophie anymore, which I kind of miss. But they were really, like, chunky and, like, heavy when I just wanted to, like, use my phone. So this is nice to carry as, like, a backup. Oh, my gosh. This is, like, so, so cool. These are so hard to find, too. The Amazon ones are crap. The Amazon ones, ugh, would not recommend. And they definitely don't look as cute as this. <laughs> oh, I've seen these on Instagram, too. I'm, like, always on Instagram. Like, I saw these on Instagram, too. Maybe I'm supposed to give one of these away, too, because I feel like there's two. 3D Vipe. Fiber mascara instructions. Oh. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, I need both these. Okay, so apply transplanting gel. So one of these is the transplanting gel. Okay, so this one's the transplanting gel, and I love the texture. First of all, the packaging of this is amazing. The the drops are actually like 3D. I really, really like that. Um, just like your normal mascara from the base of your eyeshine to the top of your lashes. So you apply the transplanting gel. Then before the gel tries, apply the fiber thinly to the lashes, exactly like step one. If applied too coarsely, eyelashes will become clumpy. Again, apply transplanting gel on top of fiber, making sure you're coating all your lashes in transplanting gel. You're applying this as you would mascara. Doing this, you are covering the fiber completely with the black transplanting gel. Repeat steps one and two again. Be sure to avoid, be sure to end with the gel to avoid shedding of the fibers. Fiber, so this is the fiber, filling to the lashes exactly like step one. And then you would put this one back on again, right on top of it, okay. How to remove. So cotton pads and warm water and apply wet pad to eye for a few seconds and then gently rub it and it's going to must never come off, which I kind of like. But gorgeous. I have seen these as well. Um, and I guess these are just the mascara. I love these so much. And again, they're so pretty. They're so pretty. I was going to give one to you guys, but I need to try them out because I'm really excited about it. Um, okay. Smile Sciences. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. I love Smile Sciences. Wait, what are these though? Because I used... I use the mouth guards for these, the Smile Sciences, so they must be like the same. You know how some companies like are all kind of the same on Instagram, but you don't really know it? Um, let me see. Oh, no crud. <laughs> I was going to say crap. I don't know if I can say crap. Teeth whitening pen. Oh, my gosh. Okay, cool. Oh. Oh, my gosh. Where's, I need a mirror. They need mirrors on the back of these. Let's see. Can you just apply the, I'm just like playing with these. I'm like literally just like a little kid right now. I'm trying to see the gel. Oh, it smells so good. It smells it smells like like the dentist, like the toothpaste, like minty. I don't know if this is like coming out or if I'm doing this wrong. Am I supposed to do this? What the heck? Let me see. <laughs> Something just happened. Oh yeah, it's coming out. Oh! Holy cow. That's amazing actually. I 
that's how you're supposed to do it. We're supposed to leave it all along. Are we supposed to take that? It's like minty. It's really yummy. I kind of like it. The bottoms, like the top of my front teeth and the bottoms of my bottom teeth always get the yellowest. Mm-hmm. Just a little touch up before I go. <laughs> awesome. I wonder if these are 40% off. Okay, so my code is, what is it, Trish for 40% off. And so I think you might get this 40% off too. I don't know. But I don't know. This is the whole... FTA registered. That's always a good sign, too. Cool. I'm obsessed. Thank you for these. Strength tea. Oh, this is bubblegum. Oh, okay. Wait, I have these two different ones. Hydrogen peroxide. 12% hydrogen peroxide is that one. And then this is a teeth whitening pen in bubblegum. Oh, hello. <gasps> yes, Biage! Yes! Oh, my gosh. These are, like, pen forms of their mouth guard, which I love the mouth guard. Oh my god, I love it. I don't think I should probably put this on top, but I love it. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. I sound like Miranda Seems. Oh my god. <coughs> Sorry. I get really excited about teeth whitening products. I get really excited. Hair flip girl. Hair flip girl. Um, <laughs> there's so... Look at all the blow pops. I don't think they sell blow pops on Simply Square, but I love that they sent me so many blow pops. I love that they sent me blow pops. I feel like that's so, like, sexual, right? Like, here's some blow pops for you to suck it, Trish. <laughs> I love it. Thanks for the blow pops. I love blow pops. The gum never lasts for me. The gum is always, like, candy. I just, like, digest it. And I know it's, like, terrible. Oh, my. Mother load, mother load, mother load. Yes, biatch. Beauty sponges. I am obsessed with these. I have no idea how much they sell these for, but I can always use these because I go through beauty blenders like nothing else. I do clean my beauty blenders, but I prefer to just get new ones. And these are awesome. I love the ones that are shaped like this, the little like, it's like putting like eyeshadows on my sweatshirt. That's great. I love these ones because these really expand and they're nice and like spongy and they're easy to hold. So you can do your foundation with this side in the middle and then you can do the concealer with this side. I love these little ones. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited about these. These are gorgeous. I love beauty. Beauty sponges on oh my ish. These are so cool. I want to do my own makeup line. How do I do that? I just love this kind of stuff. It gets me so, so, so excited. Okay. Simply spoiled pen. You know, if you want to write things down. Oh, <laughs> these are me Valentine's sweethearts. I was worried I wasn't going to get a Valentine this year, and I already got one. Thank you, Simply Spoiled. <laughs> um, okay. Well, now, what is this? Be confident. It's a bee brush. Bee brush. Fold out the brush head ready to use. Side clip to lock the head in place. Unscrew the base for tooth. Oh! Oh! Oh my gosh. Oh, cute, cute, cute. It's like a little travel brush. A toothbrush. I was like, I was so confused. I'm like, wait, what? What is this? You just put the... Oh, yes! Oh my gosh. Like, I have, like, no idea. Look how high tech this is. I don't really know what's happening here. Nope. Nope. Hmm. Fold out the brush head ready to use. Slide clip to lock the head in place. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wait. Okay. So this is toothpaste? Oh no crap. Oh there is. Look at that guys. There is toothpaste inside. That's clever. That's clever. That NASA brain cancer. Simply spoiled. You should be carrying it. That's clever. And then you just put it on there and then just slide it and then just cap it. Oh my gosh. That's that's this is clever. That is clever. I'm just I'm just saying. And then these are the last. They sent me a teeth whitening kill. Oh my god. I love mine so much. These are the ones with the mold I have done. It was in my fall favorites and I've done a full review on it. I love this little kit so much. It is so comfortable. It is so great on my teeth. And this is the one with the little, like, um, I was going to say USB light, LED light. This is amazing. This stuff is awesome. I, so I'm pretty sure then that you can either get this on the Simply Spoiled website or I'll ask him if my code will work on this website too. But I'll link everything below because this is just so much more than just a few extra products. And then these are some lip glazes. And this. Oh, Wicked and Fairy Tale. Let's open Fairy Tale first, even though I'm more Wicked in mind. Oh, oh, these are my Smile Sciences. Oh, this is so cool. I love it. I love it so much. I love it. Let's see here. And then this one's Wicked. Oh my gosh, those are so cute. They're so Barbie. It matches my sweater. I'm going to like literally be pounding on so much lip gloss right now. Let's just put it on here. 
Ooh, that's pretty. That's like a watermelony color. These are very sheer. Let's see this one. This is the wicked one. It's like mauvey. So pretty though. Oh my gosh, I'm like overwhelmed by all these beauty products. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is so amazing. Well, that was my Simply Spoiled unboxing. I'm loving everything. I Like I said, I've heard quite a bit about these on Instagram. So um, I will be trying out the shadows and definitely letting you guys know. Let me know if you guys have tried out any of the products below or are there any more I should get or which ones you're most interested in. And if you want something in a more detailed review, be sure to let me know that as well. I'm going to take them on Instagram and everything. If you want to win those glosses, go ahead and follow me on Instagram. Follow them as well. And yeah, I'll give those away to someone that follows me there. But I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. I hope you did find this interesting. I haven't done a proper unboxing in a while, so I hope you guys do enjoy it. I had a lot of fun doing it. It's like Christmas. Um, and really cool stuff. So I like I said, I'm going to try out more of this stuff and definitely let you know. Um, but yeah, if you are interested in picking up any of the things I mentioned, I will put my coupon code and links where it works and all that fun stuff. But I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. I want to say hi to Rip Miranda. So I want to time here with kisses for my little baby fishies. Bye, guys.